as surveyors of our own atmosphere near our Earth, we sometimes forget that discoveries are only set in stone until the next one comes along. A world as incredible as ours gives us answers to some questions, while leaving us with more simultaneously. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we're going to go into three of the most recent mysteries and discoveries that have left us fascinated and curious, all surrounding the expansive cosmos of outer space. NASA's spacecraft picks up some odd noises. As members of planet Earth, we have found ourselves drawn to learning about our moon over time. But what about the moons of other planets? Juno, NASA's spacecraft which launched from Florida in 2011, left Earth with the sole goal of learning more about Jupiter. After five years, it arrived. Now, in June of 2021, NASA's spacecraft has detected noises unlike any we have ever encountered. Ganymede is Jupiter's largest moon, and a 50-second audio recording, while Juno passed by in June, revealed the strange noises. An array of odd beeps and bops, all at different frequencies, were picked up. Ganymede, which is also known for being the largest moon in our solar system and the only moon with its own magnetic field, has often been intriguing. But these noises took the unknown to a whole new level. Juno's wave instrument tunes into electric and magnetic radio waves, and it picks up these waves from Ganymede's magnetic field. A full deep dive into analysing what these noises could be is actively being worked on. According to the lead co-investigator, William Kurth, it is possible the change in the frequency shortly after closest approach is due to passing from the night side to the day side of Ganymede. New data has also given indications of some likeness between Earth and Jupiter as well. Although Jupiter's energy system is on a scale much larger than Earth's, understanding the dynamics of the Jovian atmosphere could help us understand the physical mechanisms at play on our own planet, said NASA. The investigation of Jupiter will continue through to at least November of 2025, and we cannot wait to see what else is unveiled. NASA wants to build a magnetic force field and a deep sleep chamber for astronauts. NASA once again takes their explorations and impressive innovations a step further with more futuristic concepts and inventions. As of now, the Innovative Advanced Concept NIAC program is working eight selected projects, two of which involve a magnetic force field and a new habitat for astronauts. One of the challenges NASA has experienced when attempting to colonize Mars is knowing that landing on the surface risks crashing or burning up. An idea called the magnetoshell would, in theory, create a magnetic field around a spacecraft heading to Mars. Researchers are hoping that this would act as a set of brakes and possibly require less fuel for landing. After initially planning to use this for Mars and Neptune landings, now possibilities are endless, as researchers are thinking it may work for crewed missions all over in the future. Now, once crewed missions arrive, what are their habitats like? The proposed deep sleep chamber is a chamber capable of medically supporting astronauts who would be in a deep sleep. This idea originated as some missions could take years for astronauts to arrive to the destination. The idea is that this long sleep could keep astronauts feeling refreshed. Though not much is currently known about the plans for this chamber, engineers are exploring how this idea could optimize astronauts' long experiences in space. We are sure if the research proves a success that we will hear more about the Vision System Torpor Habitat, the name of the project and deep sleep chamber idea in the future. NASA's new ion thruster breaks records. The University of Michigan, in collaboration with NASA and the US Air Force, have broken records in a recent test with their new X3 thruster. Hopeful that this thruster could transport astronauts to Mars, this thruster utilizes plasma as a mode of motion, which reaches speeds greater than what can be accomplished with chemical propulsion rockets. 
Team leaders on the project are ideally thinking humans could set foot on Mars in as little as 20 years with the technology. Ion engines are more efficient and require less propellant to transport a full crew. The lead on the project, Alec Gallimore, says that the ionic propulsion can go 10 times further with roughly the same amount of fuel. Based on new knowledge, anything we can do to reduce the weight to require less fuel to get into space is ideal. The recent tests show that the X3 thruster can operate over roughly 100 kilowatts, which translates to 5.4 newtons of thrust, which is the highest to date. This also broke maximum records for power output and operating current. Like any technology, it does have some limitations. It is currently not ready for launch. Engineers are continuing to work on multiple channels of plasma rather than one, while trying to make the engine as compact as it can be, while not losing any power. Right now, the thrusters can be picked up and moved around with ease. However, the X3 version must be moved with a crane. A new shielding system is also being developed to protect the walls of the thruster. Preventing damage will allow it to operate longer. The idea of moving at the speed of light has long amazed fans of sci-fi and children in science class. The idea that we have advanced technology far enough to be able to produce rockets that can nearly approach the speed of light is incredible in itself, and the thought that this technology could bring us to Mars in a matter of years is astounding. The strides being made today are impressive, and they may even be the catalyst that sets up the upcoming generations for the largest discoveries in this millennium. We are going to keep an eye out for further updates on these exciting discoveries, and we feel assured with the mindset of the modern-day solar pioneers at NASA, we will have more to report on very soon. But what do you make of these recent discoveries? Make sure to let us know your thoughts in the comments section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.